Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our next guest is multi-platinum rap artist who makes hit after hit after hit. He even got the nod from the queen herself, Beyonce, who used his music in both, honey, of her tours. Wow. Recently, Keanu and I sat down with the platinum rapper O.T. Genesis. Yes. I want everybody to tune in to sound like this. It's a lot of respect. Tune in to sound like this. Tune in to sound like this. He has those hits that you just can't really get the hooks out of your mind. Like everybody mad, push it, and cut it. <laughs> OT Genesis, welcome to Sister Circle. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, come thank down you. here, drip, drip. That's you, how you, you, you got a whole umbrella Triple. down to your chest. Girl, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He brought his own rain. You see yeah, his necklace? When I tell you, the, these are raining, but he's still shielded from the actual umbrella. Absolutely. <laughs> now, listen, OT, you are currently on the Days and Blaze tour with Wiz Khalifa yes. and Ray Shrimmer. Yes. What is it like being on tour with those guys? It's um, it's dope. It's more of a, it's more of a vibe because everybody's, it's days and blaze meaning. Everybody days, days and blaze. And blaze. Okay. <laughs> so 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 it's 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 a whole lot of fun, and I get to build my relationships with them too. Well, the Wiz always been my friend for a long time now, nice. but um. I get to kick with Ray and them, and they're younger, so I get to show them a lot of stuff and everything like that, so it's fun. So we know that you have roots in, you were born in L.A. Yeah. Uh, you were raised yeah. in Long Beach, but yeah. your family is from Belize. Yeah, Central America. So tell me more about that. Have you used any of that Belizean um, culture to incorporate in your music at all? Um, Not yet, but I have a plan. Mm -hmm. You know, I have a plan. I'm just trying to figure everything out. Because right now, I still haven't dropped my debut album yet. Oh, yeah. So I'm still trying to figure out. It's just been single after single for mm -hmm. me. So, yeah. Well, you have a, we have something in common. You have a son who has autism. Yes. You I know, do. that is who, that is what they have. That yes. is not who they are. I also have a, a seven-year-old who has autism. Oh, wow. And um, I know what my journey's been like, but talk to us about what your journey has been like, because you've been also very outspoken about yeah. um, autism and, and what it means to you. Man, you know what? It's, um... It's been a, it's been a roller coaster, but my son is, like, improving every day. Mm -hmm. And of course, we know what that feels like, you know. Yeah. Like I said, first when I first heard, I was in so much denial. It's off the chain. And, it's, and, and, it's, and, it, and I think it really was because I didn't know what it was. Mm -hmm. like you just hear a name and you're just like, "What? What is like, that?" Like not my son, mm -hmm. you know. But um, um, you know, as I as I kept going down that road, it's 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 dope because now you have a child that's different, mm -hmm. you know. So. So the work is different, and a lot of people don't understand the work that we take as parents mm -hmm. to, you know, make sure that, you know, your son or daughter is on the right track. Exactly. And, you know, it's a neurology disorder, so, yep. you know, you always got to stay on top of things, so, yeah. but, you know. But, I'm, but, you know, what I've learned to, what I've learned through this journey is that a lot of times when, when you're musical, and, and you have a child. Mm -hmm. um, and what I've just in research, like, because Music Soul Child's son has autism as well, Zach. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even know that. And, and, and it, it could just be that they're geniuses. Yeah. And that they, I know that I learn different. You probably learn different yeah. musically, people who are creative. And I think they just, you know, maybe they just got more of a dose of the creative. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. So different can mean good. I, I feel like our children are angels yeah. and, and they're just geniuses and people just don't really understand how to connect with them. But you've also put, um, you've also put your passion in a clothing line and jewelry with autism logos. Tell me what is your reasoning for that and where do you want that to go? I just always, I always wanted to, um, shine a light on it. Mm -hmm. I always wanted to shine a light on it. And I feel like I have to, I have so much, like I have so much time and I want to do so much more. And I'm planning on doing a, a whole lot more, especially like next year. I have a lot of stuff planned. Mm -hmm. So, um, like right now, like right now, I still make sure I donate to autism awareness and everything mm -hmm. like that, and everything like that. So, um, but um, I make sure I wear, you know, autism shirts when I go out. I wear my jewelry, with my puzzle piece on there. Yeah, I'm, I'm you know what I mean? Yeah. And for those who don't know what a puzzle piece is, is finding the missing pieces. Mm -hmm. So, 
Um, I just make sure I shine a light on it, man. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm not at, I'm not at that point no more. I'm happy, you know. Right, so I right, brag right, about right, it. Right, right. Yeah. Well, speaking of all the things that you're working on, we have more with you when we come right back. Okay. Okay. Yes. We'll be back with more OT Genesis after the break. Stay with push, us. Push, 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 push. <laughs> Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our conversation continues with rapper O.T. Genesis. He talks about his new music he has coming up and how he's gotten the attention of the Queen Bee herself. Mm. I've been getting to the money. Everybody mad. I think I'm getting too much money. Everybody mad. Welcome back. We're continuing our conversation with OT Genesis. Yeah. Now listen, the people said that Beyonce, <laughs> the Queen Beyonce, is yeah. playing your music on tour. How does that make you feel? Man, it's it's a humbling experience. It's crazy though. Because with um I know like last year she was like she had like cut it in her set. Right. Or whatever, and then this year she got everybody mad in her set and she used it like from overseas now into the States. So that's a part of her set now. And when I first dropped the song, it was a lot of DJs like, man, this don't sound like, like cut it. It don't sound like, it don't sound like all the songs you did. Right. I'm just like, but I think it's a dope song. Right. So when she did it, right. Then all the DJs was like, now all of a sudden, hey, yeah. now all of a sudden, it's the now all of a sudden, right. it's like yeah. you are in the beat. Yeah. I show you are yeah. excited about that. Yeah. So I actually just performed in New York with um. Kelly opening the show nice. over there, and she when I so I actually stayed to watch the show, and I saw it incorporated in the show. I was like, oh, that is lit. Turn up. That's Wait, lit. Turn. Is that call though? Yeah. Did she call you herself and say, hey, I want to play your no, song? No, she don't got to call. She just, she I don't even know if it's in there. She just took it. She don't got to call nobody. Right. You're too lucky if it's in there. Yeah. Right. Speaking of which, we need to call and tell her to put cash on it. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is yeah, your new yeah. single. Tell yeah. us about the new single, and is it different from Cut It or and every everything it's else? Kind of, or is it kind of the same? It's kind of the same vibe. It's just it's just all about having having fun, man, and having a good time. So most of my most of my songs, like I'll be talking about something, but I really, like my hooks, my hooks stick out yeah. and everything like that, just so you know people can vibe, like a, like a chant, have a good time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, so you mentioned you are working on a new album. What can yeah. we expect from that? Uh, r really, the new album this at the, before the year is over. Hopefully October. I'm aiming for October. I'm looking for, aiming for early October. Cause I can't. I, it's time for me to drop my debut album. Oh, that's Fine. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah, that's how I feel about everything. everything right. <laughs> so, are some of the standout songs that you have any that we should be looking out for? Um, right now, I have cash on it right okay. now. And then, um, I'm dropping just waiting to get off the tour so I could just let everything go. Nice. Yeah. Well, we are so excited. We are so excited to be able to speak to you. Thank we you. wish Me you the too. best of luck, mm -hmm. and we hope to get all your songs down to the on the run tours yeah. so that we can turn <laughs> up, <laughs> and you can catch him on his own tour in a city near you. So be on the lookout for him and everything that he is doing, especially social media wise. Ot Absolutely. Genesis in the house. Thank you so much. Yes. Right. Give it up Yay. for Ot Genesis, y'all. Right. <laughs> yes. Now leave the rain. Uh, the, the umbrella. Just the umbrella. Right. Just the umbrella. I'll take it. I'll just take a rain. Well, listen, you can catch him. He's touring all over the country through August. Mm -hmm. And of course, the conversation always continues at Sister Circle <laughs> TV on all social media platforms. Yeah. <laughs> all I wanted was a raindrop. Raindrop <laughs> of, of diamonds.